So what's in these boxes? Christmas for Kimmy. Happy I'm cancer free. Happy new job. Happy National Board for Professional Teaching Standards paycheck. Happy I'm a teacher who's on her feet all day long and doesn't want her feet to get hurt and I'd rather wear cheap clothes than cheap shoes. Let's see what's inside of them, shall we? This is going to be exciting for me. These are freeboard boots that are three years old. They've held up very well. They're super, super comfortable. <clears throat> Let's see what these look like. I know, cutting away. <clears throat> Beautiful. I'm going to open all the boxes first. Free Bird by Steven. Let's see what this is. Oh, it tells me. Oh, it's my, my packing slip, and tell me I can return it if I want to. So I'm going to open all these boxes first, and then I'll open the, the little boxes. There's one. Yay. Let's open the big ones first. These are called Timber. I got all my shoes in size 7. Oh, look at that. Mm. These are the Timber boots. I got them in size 7. I got them in size 7 in the beige multi. They come nicely wrapped up like this. Look at those. Those are gorgeous. Let's look at some of the detail. It has a studded, braided band that goes under the heel. Most of the soles have the free bird stamp on the heel on the uh, soles of the shoes. Very nice, a little bit scuffed up. Mine are going to be scuffed up anyway. I don't mind that worn look. Let's get some more detail on this. Very nice. It doesn't have a sewn down edge. Very nice. So here's the timber in beige multi, straight out of the box. Now see this, this is a nice, 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 nicely done. Let's see if I can get this out of here. They have a foam rubber insert with a little, I guess, denim cap to put on it, and I'll be able to use that to put back in here to help them keep their form. I'm actually going to have to trim a little bit of this off because, or put a rubber band around it because it's just a little too tight to um, easily work down in here. I could put it just like that. And it'll be fine, but if I want to go, have it to go down further to keep from wrinkling that, I'm going to have to trim the bottom part down. But again, just look at the detail on these boots. They're gorgeous. I look forward to trying them on. I got these because, um, while black and brown will go with everything, I'm just deciding that this color is going to go with everything as well. And I like that they're not just perfect. That they're already look they look a little used and worn in. Very beautiful. 
Next up are the Manchester boots and I have to tell you that I have been coveting these boots from pictures and ads on Facebook for a long time. I hope they look as good in person as they did on the ads. Let's see, shall we? Again, it's wrapped in the fall. These are the purple crocodile version. <laughs> Don't they look beautifully evil? I've also decided that purple is going to go with everything just like people decided that black goes with everything and blue jeans go with everything and khaki goes with everything. I've just decided purple is going to go with everything because I'm letting my hair go gray and washing it with purple dyed shampoo. So here's where we're headed. These are likely to be the least exciting boots of the whole bunch because these are just, um, they're just plain boots with a strap and a little ring on the uh, outside of the heel. They're called Santiago. I got them in black. Again, size sevens. But I needed like a basic, just a basic black boot. Again, it has a little form protector in there. They're not really black. They're sort of brown, brown, black it maybe. I would have liked for them to have been a little bit darker. But that's okay. Again, they have the Freebird stamp on the sole. They have a nice heel. And they just have like the like fry boots and dingoes where it has the three straps and the little metal ring on it. Stitched around the top. Just a nice boot. So these are my basic boots. My just go to's like my basic boots. Now these I expect I'm either going to just think they're awesome. I'm gonna really just hate them, but we'll see what they do. They're called whiskey. And I got the ones, they are called Mood Ring, and they're supposed to change color in natural sunlight. So they probably won't change color in here, but when they go outside, they're supposed to. So normally, they look like this. They're like a taupe, beigey, light color. They are not quite as dark as the, the boots I have, but when they're exposed to natural sunlight, which is the sun's all gone down now, they're supposed to turn purple. We'll have to test that tomorrow. But they also have the three buckle with a ring on them. It has a pull tab on the back with metal uh, decoration on it. It has the stitching on the side here. It has a lot of details besides just the color changing. It's got like a embossed skin on it, stitched all the way around the toe. Again, oh, this one doesn't have, I'm sorry, this one doesn't have the free bird on the bottom of it. It just has like the rubber tire tracking. It has like the square um, kind of masculine toe, which I kind of like. And what I read about this one on the review is it doesn't have a zipper opening. So you just have to squeeze your foot into it, which some people say it was not a problem. But it does have elastic on the side to help you. And it's got elastic on that side. So if you can't get your foot in on the thinner part down here, then that's going to be a problem. But my, my feet are pretty skinny, so it shouldn't be a problem. So here's what those look like from the front view. Here's side and inside. And here's the rear. Thanks for watching my unboxing video about my beautiful Freebird boots. They are gorgeous, aren't they? They smell wonderful. Check back and I'll do an individual review on each one and try it on and wear it and see how they fit, the comfort and all that good stuff. But for right now, I did want to share with you that I'm very satisfied with the way that they all look. Look at the diversity in color. Pretty cool, huh? Thanks for watching. Remember, it's free to like, subscribe, leave a comment, share this video if appropriate. And if you've got time before you leave YouTube, watch one of these videos and just find something beautiful and the ordinary today. Thanks. Bye.